Yes, I'm in short text. I'm a very old driver. Okay, prove it. Yeah. Get out of the car. No, I'll give you my idea. I don't have to get out of my car. Here's another example of how the police confuse what they want with what the law says and how they believe that any demand they make is backed up by force of law. In this case, a police officer has pulled over a driver under Section 163 of the Road Traffic Act and asked him to provide his details under Section 165. To make his job easier, he wants the driver to leave his vehicle and sit in the back of the patrol car. That way, the officer can get nice and comfy while he writes out a ticket and also put the driver at a disadvantage of feeling that he's been in prison and won't be released until he complies. The police make these requests all the time and 99% of the British public willingly obey without ever realising how greatly it disadvantages them. The police get so used to such gutless surrender that they quickly forget that it's a request and start to believe that it's an order and that failure to comply is an arrestable offence. It isn't. Nothing in the Road Traffic Act creates the offence of failing to exit a vehicle when a police officer requests you to do so, unless he intends to arrest you for a named offence. You don't have to exit your vehicle during a police stop. You don't have to wind down your window. You don't even have to speak to the officer. Section 165 doesn't compel anyone to speak, even when details are requested, as you're just as entitled to show an officer your documents in silence. I've already made a video about police powers during vehicle stops, which I recommend you take a look at, linked in the description. There's your, my ID, and check it. Didn't refuse to comply with the rules. That's right, I'm going to wait for another officer. Hand me your keys. I'm not going to hand you my hand keys. Why? Keys. I don't need because to. I'm not driving away anywhere. I'm not driving away anywhere. That's why I pulled in a secure location. You want to be done for obstruct police? What, for what? Obstruction for what? I'm trying to do, I'm trying to for do what? a road traffic check. No, on check you. it. Go check it. Go check it. Yeah. Once you've given the. Uh, I'm you've going to. Listen, you're going to get into a lot of trouble, I'm telling you. Trust me. You force yourself. Trust me, you are. You assaulted me. You opened my door. You don't need to get in my car. You Trust don't me. have you don't have a crimi Until criminal suspicion on me. You don't. You no. can't just open anybody's car. Okay. Me, I'm not give giving me the keys. Look at that. Look at that. Until I know that everything's legit. Everything is legit. You can't just force yourself on me. Give me your hand now. You're damaging my hand. You're damaging my hand. Right. Take off your seatbelt. Take off your seatbelt. I'm, I'm not. Look at this. Give me your hand now. Look at it. Look at this. Give me your hand now. Look at this officer. I'm going to sue him. I'm going to sue him. Give me your hand now. For what reason? Give me what you your reason? hand. What reason do you want to arrest me for? Oh! Give me your hand now. Oh! Let go of the phone. No. You need to do a police check. Do it. Give me the phone. Can you record him, please? Give me your hand. No, I'm not. Let the other police officer come. As is typical with the delicate sensitivities of grown men in uniform, the officer takes offence to this man's rightful refusal not to leave his vehicle and arrests him by force for obstruction. A bogus charge which is quickly dropped once the cop feels that his demands have been met, having dragged him from his vehicle. But take a good look. This officer is the poster child of everything that is wrong with the modern generation of police officers. A robotic, self-entitled recruit who thinks that a police uniform trumps all civil rights and he can do whatever he pleases in his bid to exert power over complete strangers. If you comply, then it I did. Go like I gave you my ID okay, too. I did give you. No, I'm not going to. I don't have to come out of the car to prove my ID. I'm guessing that this officer's head was no stranger to the inside of a urinal when he was at school. And now he gets to act out all of his insecurities on total strangers and use society at large as a huge therapy session in a bid to confront his own inadequacies and psychological damage. This officer is not the exception. He is the rule. The police are not a barrel full of rosy looking fruit poisoned by a few bad apples they are a huge industrial tankard of rotten cider with maybe a few good apples bobbing about, waiting to be pulled under by the wake of corruption, unaccountability and incompetence that defines policing in Great Britain. 
At the moment, what I'm no. going to do is I'm going to arrest you on suspicion of um, obstructing police, okay? For what? Obstruction for what? It's recorded on here! It's recorded on here, mate! It's recorded on here! It's recorded on here! I'm not complaining. Do you see me telling him I gave him my license? Uh, I wasn't here. Right, so it's unrecorded here. I wasn't here at the start. Okay, so do you want to. No! Do you want to take your seatbelt off? You're Can under, you? You're under you have a senior there. officer here. Which is your? Who is the senior officer here? Sir, you're under arrest. No, now, I'm not under. Know. Just hold on one second. Who's the senior officer here, please? I'm the senior officer here. There isn't any. No. So how how do I get to see the senior officer? In custody. Down in custody, there is a sergeant that you'll be able to speak. I've got an appointment. I'm suffering. I've got an appointment with the GP and hospital for my back. That's fine, but at the moment you're under arrest because you've not complied. You've I didn't say not complied. He pulled me over on there, yeah, and he says, oh, you were driving like an idiot. I said, listen, I'm nearly 50 years old. Don't say I'm, I'm an idiot, you know. And from then he said, pull into the safe location. I'll follow you. From there I pulled in here. Why is he have not complied about, you tell me? This officer's... I already arrested you for obstruction. We want to hear to But why is it the obstruction? Alright, yeah? tell me what have I obstructed? Know, Did I say to him I don't want to give him my ID? Did I say to I wasn't him? Here to answer that, I? Well I am I'm telling you this is what he's doing. He okay. pushed himself, he damaged my car. You've not even seen because you've not been out of your car. Yeah, but you rammed the key out of that thing. I pulled your key yes, out. Yes. Yeah. You did? Okay, do you want to take your seat about us so we can get this done? I'd much rather get you in the back of the car, get everything sorted. He said Get in back of my car for what? And then so I said, no, you need to, I need to give you my details. I'll give you my details. Sir, you why, do why do you want to arrest me for? If you do everything that I ask. No, no, you're not authority over me. You're a public servant, my friend. Unfortunately. You're not. When I, when Are you I a public servant or not? Are you a public servant or not? Unfortunately, at the moment, you've been stopped and you're not and complying what, with what you're being Why is it that I have not complied about? Did I, did I refuse to give you my ID? Did I refuse to give you my license? You refuse to get out of the car. So Why do I need to get out of the car? Which right. loss is I need to get out of the car? Right. Look, stop. Give me your hand. I will. Just hold on. I will. I will. One second. I okay. will. Don't need then. to force me. Okay. Don't need Give to force me. Hand. I'm saying to you, I'm coming out. Tell him yeah. to stop behaving like an idiot. Well, stop behaving. Okay. There, I'm coming out. Okay. Don't take my phone off, man. Right. Get out. Put your hand let behind me. your back. Okay, let me. Pass this listen. So you don't get it broken. We don't want your phone breaking, do we? One second. There is the keys not turning on there. Sir, see what I mean? What we're you see today. what I mean? Now, who's going to wash my car here? Well, if you can buy everything in the back of the car, no, then you, you won't have to You come don't down have to get me out of the car. That's your right, only problem, sir. is. Come on. Give me your other hand. Get behind your back. Give my colleague your phone. We're not on operating. On a different subject, and since my last upload, YouTube have switched off all monetization across my entire channel ad revenue that was going some way to keeping the content flowing. But I've had so much amazing support from running this channel with subscriptions almost doubling in just two months. I'm determined to keep going as long as people keep watching. If you wish to support this channel, then please consider purchasing one of the e-products I sell from my website or maybe making a donation. This has become a full-time endeavor and I'm grateful to everyone who's donated, purchased, subscribed and supported me and kept me going. Thank you.